Hey guys, glad to see you back at the channel. Um, today I wanted to give you guys some uh, more tips on how to uh, make money. I wanted to give you specific filters and um, specific things to invest in uh, in the current time period. These are going to work for right now, obviously, if you're watching this later. They may or may not work. It's something to you know look into and see if they're still valid, but also learn from it and learn that you can make these filters yourself and create them yourself. But I wanted to give you guys some specifics to work with and get going. A lot of people found so much success watching my first video and my second video. Go check those out if you haven't. Um, basically, I'm going to give you, uh, like I said, two filters that are going to help you out. And I'm going to give you two things that you should be investing in. This works. My viewers always say it works. Um, anybody who's watched it has said they've made money when they actually put in the effort. I've only been playing for two to three months. You guys see I have $600 million. I spent a lot doing giveaways for you guys. And I've spent a ton buying cars that I want and several of each rare car just because that's what I like to do. Um, so you could definitely make max money. I could have had max money. Um, it's worth it. This stuff works. I'm never going to lie to you guys. I shoot you completely straight. This is this is the real deal. This is how you guys are going to make money in this game, be able to get all those cars you want. All right, so we're going to start out with the thing I always preach, festival playlist. This one's a big one. This is super important. Like the Quadra release, right now we have the Jesco. Take advantage of this. They might be hard to snipe like the Quadra, but it's a great investment. Grab these Jeskos, hold on to them for a week or two, maybe even longer, or flip them immediately. We're going to have them getting posted. I haven't looked into it too much. I'm sure they're like the Quadras where they're getting bought up pretty fast. People are pretty smart about that. They're probably going to be pretty smart about this. Um, Take a look at those. Try to invest in those. If you can't get those, here's a second investment opportunity that you guys have. The Velociraptor. Now hear me out. This car was selling for 12 million credits. Last week, the week before, the month before that, it's been selling for 12 million credits since it came out. Take advantage of this. When I tell you they are going for cheap, I mean it. I have picked up something like 10 or 12 of these things, as I'll show you right now. Um, I've paid 700K, 800K, 100K. I've never gone over 2 million. They're so cheap. You guys need to capitalize on this. Pick these up as fast as you can. They're going to go back up. It, whether it's $6 million or $8 million, they're going to go back up. They might not go back up to $12 million, but they are going to raise in price. You guys need to take advantage of this one. This is one that everybody can get in on. All you need is a million to start. You can either instant flip it for profit. You can either instant flip it for profit, or you can uh, look to go for the more long-term games gains. Um, like I said, these are going for so cheap. And the three million range, I wouldn't pay three to four million. If I were you, I'm gonna show you a smart thing that I did with the M3 GTS when it came out not too long ago. This is how I made 35, 40 million when I first started playing this game. So anybody can do it. These right here, these ones with like the the 200k bids or whatever. Like I said, try to pay under a mil, under two mil. Slap your bid ends, pit bids in on these things. As you can see, the first 10 or so Hennessy Velociraptors that are posted are in the 100k range. You know, or are in the I mean, are ending in a minute. And if they're under 100K or 200K or whatever, get your bids on them. And they can even be up to, like I said, a million or so. Make sure you're paying attention to what you're bidding on. Keep under that two mil mark, but slapping bids on these. Make sure you focus on one. A problem that I had is when is that if I get too greedy and I'm trying to bid on all of these at one time, I'm not going to win them all. You have to make sure you pick one, you focus on it, and you try to win it. If they're all ending at the same time, try to try to lean towards one. Right now, like I shouldn't be bidding on this third one because the first one's ending soon and going to end. So I need to focus on that first one and try to get it. Make sure I get my bids in. The last person to get their bids in are going to win. So just keep spamming this. And if it's about to end and it's still under a million, just keep going because you're going to win that thing for under a million. And it's going to be a fantastic investment. These are going to go back up. Like I said, whether it be 6 mil, 8 mil, whatever the case, make sure you guys are getting these. I'm telling you. These are going to be big for those for those of you who have a little bit less money and can't make those huge investments. Just get these bids in. Trust me, trust me, trust me. This is the best way to do it. I wouldn't particularly sit there and try to snipe these. Um, the buyout method, like the traditional sniping method, I would, I would, uh, I would uh, sit here and bid on them. This is going to be a much uh, cleaner way for you to get... Um, consistent winnings on these um, it's gonna be very tough if you try to snipe these with buyout I don't think it's gonna be impossible but I think you're gonna have more success going this route 
So, so try this out. Don't do what I'm doing where I'm bidding on both at the same time. Pick one. Stick with it. Whichever one's ending sooner. I think this bottom one's ending sooner. So, we'll focus on this bottom one real quick. It's only at 195K. So, like, I could really get this win here. Keep refreshing it. It's so low. So, it doesn't even matter what the price is at this point since it's ending so soon. Boom. We got the win. Now, we can focus on this one. This might get a bid failed because I didn't refresh. Make sure you guys are refreshing. Yep. Make sure you guys are refreshing. It's only 160k, so whatever the bid, I just gotta keep bidding. It's gonna end before yeah, I already lost. But if I would have gotten that bid in, I would have gotten it for 140k. I just got one for 230k. I could flip this right now for three to four million. Now you have more money to invest. Keep doing that within a few hours. You get 25, 25 posts a day. Within a few hours, you could be up to 50 million. I know it sounds like a long shot, but it's not. This is a consistent, easy way to make money. It's not that complicated. You just have to hit the right timings a few times. You lose some. You win some. You guys will make money doing this. Pick one that's ending soon. Focus on it. Target it. Try to get it. If you don't, move on to the next one after you collect your credits. If you need the money now, flip it and sell it immediately. Get that profit. And then start to maybe invest and hold on to them longer. Or if you keep getting it for 200 k just flip them for $4 million if that's what you feel more comfortable with. These are great investment opportunities. You guys are going to make a lot of cash doing this. I know you will. Um, next up, I want to get into some filters for you guys. Um, last time we talked about the GMC filter. We talked about the Toyota filter. I want to give you guys a Ferrari filter. All, all of those guys out there who love Ferraris. Um, these are a great way to make money, obviously, but also really fun cars to have, and it's a little bit more fun to snipe. There's a pretty large variety of cars in this filter I'm going to show you. So what we want to do is we want to put a max buyout from 1.1 to 2 million. This is at current standing, obviously, uh, the current standing of the auction house. So uh, keep that in mind. Um, max buyout, you can do 2 million. Now, the only problem with this is, um, actually, I'll, I'll get to that in a second. Uh, source, all unique cars, and then you're going to do 2010s, all right? Now, like I said in uh, previous videos, when you search this, you're going to have to press search and then press your advanced options and then hit confirm again. Otherwise, it's going to delete all those advanced filters. And you're going to have to do that every time. Get the timing down. You guys will be good. Now, the reason I say 2 million is because at about 3 million, ignore me messing up already and ignore the lag. Um, at about 3 million is when you're going to start to see um, like the Portofinos and the 488 Pista. Pista, Pista, whatever you call it. That's when you're going to start seeing these. So make sure if you do, the reason I say 1.1 to 2 is because if you're going to do 2, you need to pay attention. If you're going to do 2, you need to pay attention. If a Portofino or a Pista pops up for 2 million, don't buy that. You're not going to make any money or maybe you'll make 200K. Maybe you'll make your money back, but that's not the investment you'll make. I do that because in this category, you will get 812 super fast, the ultra rare $20 million car. You will get Portofinos. You will get 599 XX Evos, which are any from, you know, 8 mil to 20 mil. Obviously, to sell for 20 mil, you have to have legendary tuner or painter. Um, you're going to get the 599 XX, the non-Evo version. I'm pretty positive it's in this category. Um, that goes for around 2 million. And then you're going to get the 488. Now, 1.1 million is a good price to pay for any of those. If you get the Portofino or the normal 599 or the Pista, you're going to be able to sell those for 2, 3 mil. So you're going to make, you know, at least double your profit, which is the rule I explained in my previous videos. You want to make at least double the 50% rule. Make sure you guys are paying less than half or half of what you're trying to snipe. Now, this is a great filter. Like I said, this includes Evos. This includes 812s. You're going to get all of those popping up in this filter. This is a big win and a small win filter at the same time. You guys can get those big dubs and those smaller auction dubs using this filter. All right, it's, it's really good. Gives you some Ferraris. Like I said, just make sure you're smart and do not buy those cars for $2 million if you're going to do that. And if you don't think you control, can control yourself from buying them for $2 million, don't be afraid to drop that down to $1.1 million. You're not going to miss out on much. It's okay. And then you just keep refreshing it like, like I've explained in previous videos. Make sure you hit that uh, advanced options and uh, you should be all good. That's going to make you some really good money. It's a really great filter. Um, next up... Uh, and my final filter is um, the Formula Drift filter. This is going to be more of a big hitter filter. It's going to be like a big win um, type of filter. So as you guys know, I use the unique cars a lot because it gives you those cars that you can't you know, easily obtain. Um, and it basically just gives you all the cars that are worth good money. Now, a tricky part with this filter, because of the current time, last week, 
Formula Drift Corvettes um, were part of the festival. So those are in high supply, meaning that you're going to see a lot of them um, for low prices. I picked up a couple for eight, nine hundred K. You're going to see a lot for a million right now. Um, you check this filter, you saw, you know, you see, I grabbed a couple of these cause you know, for 800 K, I mean, I can easily fuff them for 2.1 when they go back up in price again. Um, you can pick some up for eight or 900 K. I wouldn't get a ton just to play it safe. They might sit at a million for a little bit. Um, might be a tricky investment at the time being, but this is why I say this is a big hitter, uh, filter, because what we're going to do is we're going to do 500 to 700 K bio. I'd say buy anything under 700 K, but for those of you who want to play it safe, I'd go 500 K. Those of you who don't have a lot of money can do this, and it hits big. Um, 500K, all unique cars. And what you're going to find in this filter is Formula Drift Ferrari 599s, which go for about $8 million right now. Um, a lot of people post those up, surprisingly, for 138K, you know, snipeable buyouts. Um, and then you're also going to find the Formula Drift 370Z, and those 370Zs are going for anywhere from 8 to $10 million. And then the third and final car that you're going to find is that Formula Drift Corvette. And those are going to probably go back up to $2 million if I have a guess. The price seems to level up, level out and get back to one7 to $2.1 whenever, uh, whenever they're uh, handing them out a lot and stuff like that. It seems, it seems to come back and stabilize at one7 to the $2.1 million range. So they might be an okay investment right now. I would tread lightly with the with the corvettes but this is a good this is a good filter that gets those 370z's and those 599's in there and then corvettes for quick profit you can buy those for 500k sell them for a million or you can hold on to them and sell them for 2 million make about 1.5 a piece that's for those of you with a lot more disposable income that want to make a more long-term investment um so that kind of plays in with the investment and the filter area but these are two more great filters for you guys um Make sure you guys go back and check my first video if you haven't seen it for a really, really, really great GMC filter. Made me easily two, three hundred million. And uh, also the uh, Toyota filter, which is awesome for getting those cool, cool, cool um, Toyota filters. Uh, or uh, Toyota cars, I mean. Um, obviously, they're fantastic for drifting and super fun cars in general. Great for playground games and uh, super fun just in, you know to play with. So uh, that's kind of all I have for you guys today. Wanted to give you guys another video that kind of uh, hooks you up with some more filters and investment ideas so you guys can go out there and make some more cash if you are having trouble in the creativity department with uh, some of the sniping stuff. Um, I notice a lot of people understand the concept and they're understanding what I'm showing them but can't quite formulate uh, specifics and, and things that are going to make them money and I've been asking questions in the comments and in my stream so that's why I wanted to hook you guys up with this video. It's just another little, you know little bit of a helper um hopefully you guys can take it and develop into something bigger and start to learn from the actual videos and be able to do this on your own and you know understand the when the new seasons come out and stuff like that that you need to take advantage of that um but yeah that's about it i appreciate all your guys support i've noticed so many of you guys have been following me and such from the youtube channel and the youtube channel we've, we've gotten 50 i think 50 subscribers in the past week which is just crazy how much support you guys have been getting me um, I really, 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 really appreciate that. The We got 55 likes on the last video so far. Tons and tons of comments on both videos. You guys you guys are awesome. Please keep up that support. It helps so much. I hope to see you guys in the stream. I actually uh, record with uh, Streamlabs and got two followers while recording, you know, 10 minutes ago and had to restart it. So uh, I really do appreciate all that support. And I hope I see you guys in the stream. Uh, I have two new wheels coming in. I got the Sparco Rally Wheel. And an F1, an F1 Ferrari wheel for my Thrustmaster to go with the 599 Evo wheel that I have and uh, my uh, Fanatic handbrake. Um, hope to see you guys come by, do some drift competitions, earn some cars. We do some giveaways, hang out, have a fantastic time. I really hope to see you guys in the stream. It's going to be in the outro right after this ends. Um, if you guys need that link, and it, I should be in the description down below. I appreciate you guys so much. Uh, good luck sniping. Thank you so much for all that support, and have a fantastic New Year's.